New up pack in the air, guess what? He'll still be alive right now if you niggas ain't guess what? Get my shorty statements and guns, I tell him slap for nothing. Everybody with this gang ain't shit. What is poppin'? Y'all, your girl is back. To the back. To the mm mm. To the back. To the mm mm. To the back. Yep, I'm back. To the back. Got another video, schmidio, idiot. Listen, today we're getting cute. I lately have been feeling crusty, dusty, and musty. Not musty, never that. But anyways, sis, my girls at World New Hair. World New Hair. Love yourself. Start from your hair. So that's what we're doing today, obviously. And they sent me some cute stuff in this package. They sent me a little pack of makeup brushes. I actually use these when I travel, and I did need a new spoolie. So hold on. Okay, send me a little, a little darky, little dark, 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 whatever, whatever. Ooh, and they sent me some little Mac lashes. They sent me this cute pen. It says, "Girls, who run the world, girls?" And ooh, yes, girl, they give me them good gifts. This is like a leather, like, cute little pouch. It says World New Hair. Sis, I can put all my little hair stuff in here. So, thank you, World New Hair, for this cute little pouch. I'm definitely going to use that. And I like this little, little lip. Let's get into it. Today, we are dealing with A1B, as you can see, 613, body weight, 24, 24, 24 inches. Girl, this hair is cute, first of all. Look at this parting. Hold on. Y'all know how I get with the middle part. So here is what the parting looks like on this wig. It is a 613-1B, as I said. I think this is a 13 by 4 frontal, if I'm not mistaken. But I will have everything below, as I always do. This hair is super soft, tangle-free. But look at the color. Like, that's very cute. So I'm excited to see how this is going to look on me so today let's just get straight into this install today we are doing a new bald cap method and i'm gonna show you what i'm gonna do a lot of people think wigs are a protective style which they are if you do them correctly when you are constantly spraying your edges down with got to be glue like very alcohol based hair sprays you're gonna do damage to your edges so i'm going to show you today what i do to ensure that my edges are being protective and that this wig is going to be a protective style and not just something that really is actually hurting me in the end what i do first is just cut this off right here because we gonna need we gonna need it like that girl all right you want to pull this down till it's only the cap there's none of this lining right there and what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut in front of our hairline snip 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 small snips not a lot because you don't want to go too much boom take some bold hold and put that right there on the end right on the end sis and you're gonna lay it down this is also gonna help your bald cap look like it's melted for real like you're gonna see at the end how this bald cap's just gonna look completely melted into my skin so yeah just go ahead and do that real quick i'm looking this way because the mirror is that way but you just want to melt it, hold it so it stays. Boom. And it melts so much that you literally can't even tell the ball cap's there. It's going to make the ball cap look as though like it's your skin, which is a good thing. And it's still covering and protecting your edges. Do it again. And literally do this all around, y'all. Um, moving on to world new hair. This is actually gonna be my first time pairing with them So I'm excited to see what they got to offer. Just keep on pulling And pasting pull paste pull paste This is honestly the best way to do your ball cap. I don't care I said it because when you're spraying your edges down girl, you are making your edges weak and it's not a protective style Keep on going keep on going like tell me that doesn't look like skin like it looks like skin now because it's so blended like they're they're just not ready for it they're just really not so now we look like real life bald but it's okay uh-uh because i hate one thing about like freaking wig glue it gets all over your nails and stuff now that the ball cap's on and secure we can start with our one layer of our bold hold and 
a pattern and now this way girl you can really like you can really glue this thing down this is the best way to lay your ball cap like that's it that's it case closed remember to only um put half of the glue on at a time because this dries hecka quick I'm hoping to slay this hair. I'm very much hoping to slay her. I'm the Vanessa. All right, so do the whole thing over again. Yep, yep, yep. I'm trying to copy that same exact type of pattern because you want it to be glued the same on each side. So I saw how I went lower here, so I went lower there as well. And then I like to kind of just spread it backwards so that way it kind of gives it more of a place to stick instead of just a little bit you want you know what I'm saying a more broad sticking okay all right so now this glue is like drying already so we're gonna give it a quick little dry real quick okay so now glue's dry wow this is really crazy like Here's what the back of the ball cap looks like if y'all was wondering. I did braid this down. I think I have like five braids in. Yeah, something like that. Okay. So here's my wiggy wiggy wiggy. Okay, let's just get a little bit of I really like this part. Like, see this. You're looking very much slayed. And I'm really feeling it. So most wigs come with this like flap in the back in case you want to lay it down, but I never do because that's doing too much. So I just cut it all put it on crooked <laughs> it's not shift all right i think that's the middle okay so i'm now just gonna go ahead and just press this in as i always do it's important to do this just so your way can really be stabilized sis Nobody's snatching our wigs off today. All right, so once you've got it on, we're going to go ahead and melt it with our blow dryer. love me a little blondiana get your scissors and get a clip because these ear tabs yeah they gotta go so for your ear tabs you basically kind of just want to line it up with the tip of your ear and wherever that lace is cut straight down so my ear goes right here so i'm gonna just follow that line and cut curve boom now my ear can nicely go out like this very comfortably it's out all the way do it on the other side ears up boom 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 and now my favorite part to cut the lace to cut the lace hey. i like this because you know what i'm saying some people don't want a straight 613 hair which is understandable some people aren't comfortable with that so a nice transition is getting like something with a colored root even if it's like a 30 613 a 30 is kind of like a brown color if it's a 27 which is more of like an orangish or you know just going with a 1b like okay so now i'm gonna go ahead and start to cut my lace so i start going sideways and then i take the scissors and i cut straight up Okay, so here is how it's looking. If I had the time, I would fix this dying thing, but it's okay. We're just going to wand it out. You know what I'm saying? Do you or do you not? Okay, just take a little section like this. A wand is so helpful when you're doing your wigs and stuff. It's just so easy to get perfect curls. Like, all you gotta do is wrap it around and you're gonna see i'm about to look like shirley temple over here like you just look so cute yes Ooh, that's a cute 
nice little wave yes 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 this hair is mad thick y'all like mad thick i give y'all credit because you're gonna get your money's worth you you definitely gonna get your money's worth because some companies be skipping you like it's 180 percent density and it feel like a 115 like come on now but yeah you definitely get your money's worth i like how my eyebrows look lifted <laughs> because the the wig's so tight oh yes okay i like that this hair does curl very easily and this is definitely an affordable place to get wigs y'all are always asking me i need affordable places i need affordable places. world new hair world new hair y'all better check them out this hair is mad soft i really like how it's curling right now like very loose beautiful beachy waves all right y'all so i'm gonna go ahead curl this whole head because i know y'all don't want to sit here and watch me do it and we'll be back for the final result halfway done girl this do be taking you know what i'm saying a little bit of time but it's gonna be worth it in the end and my favorite part honestly is like in the end and then you get to comb it all out with a wide tooth comb and then you look so beautiful and it was all worth it in the end i see y'all when i'm done curly 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 y'all my favorite part now let's give this some volume you always want to comb it out with a wide tooth y'all or it's going to mess up the curls so i'm getting a lot of volume with this hair which i like so here is the finished look again this beautiful unit is from world new hair all the links will be in my description to shop with them as always do not forget to like comment subscribe and share and check the links in my description go ahead and shop with them i love y'all so much and i'll see y'all next video Mwah.